Hi folks, welcome back to my channel. Hope you're all doing what? What on earth? We are currently experiencing technical difficulties. It appears some festive gremlins have gotten into the works and are wreaking havoc on the editing software. Please bear with us while we rectify this issue. Go on. Go. Now with them gone, let's get back to normal programming. Let's go. folks welcome back to my channel hope i hope you're all doing well um i am in a very cold but dry black pool this evening oh god just on just on the tram on the way here uh, i've not been out of fleetwood for a week and a bit um and it's just been so so good uh, just to have a bit of a break from black pool even though I, I love the place um it's just been so so good just you know just to chill at home and um the people that i've gotten rid of uh, that, I, that i mentioned in my mental health video it's just been so so good just to uh you know get in contact with myself again and just um get myself back to normal it really has um but what i thought i'd do is t this evening i'd come out to the platform and just film a bit of uh, a winter sort of uh, look around video um we've already more or less covered uh, what's on the headland for this year um, but there's a few things that are around town that i want to go and show you folks um but yeah i hope you enjoyed that intro um i've i've been thinking about it for the past well for the past day i've been thinking about it all day since i woke up um just how i'm gonna do that intro uh, but yeah let's go and have a look around the town center side to see, see what's going on um the um the booster ride is up there as well i've just been to i've just been there walk, I just had a walk through the, the uh, christmas village um, but yeah, it's just been so so good just to, to take a bit of a, have a bit of a break from Blackpool and um, just you know sort of linger around Fleetwood for a bit, get some rest and stuff that I, that I really did uh, sort of need. So um, yeah, I'm feeling energised and ready to, to get this video done. Um, I just thought I would, uh, even though I'm taking a bit of a break from YouTube at the moment, um, I just thought I would, I just thought I would film this video for you folks. So. Um, yeah, let's go and just go and have a look around the town centre, shall we? There's something across the road that I want to go and show you folks as well. Um, so yeah, I need to cross back over, however. So I shall catch you folks uh, over the road. Okay, folks, I'm in the town centre now. Um, this is what I wanted to show you. This is new. This was only put here a few days ago. It's basically like a, a giant present. Um, so through the town centre. You can 
so that we're, we're going to have a look at when the garden's having it. Um, but yeah, this is just, this has only been here a few days. Yeah. Um, I saw it on social media being put up. So yeah, they've got the um, concrete slabs. I just to keep it just to keep it down. Um, but yeah, let's go and have a look around the town centre, shall we? Um, the winter gardens are up there as well. Um, we've got one of the amusements. This is the new amusements um, on the promenade. Um, you got the Golden Mile as well, which is a little bit further up. Um, and then you've obviously got the um, the tower up there as well. And then this is all Bank Hay Street, all of this. And we've got the, um, the Christmas lights up there as well. So you've got the Christmas lights up there and then um, all the way down Bank Hay Street. We will go and have a look down Bank Hay Street in a minute. And then we have um, the, all the ones leading up to the Winter Gardens. The Winter Gardens is actually open um, tonight. Last time it came it was all shut up. But the Winter Gardens is, is actually open. So might have a, uh, might have a walk through. Might have a walk through uh, if it's actually open. So. Yo, I'll see you folks at St John Square because there's another Christmas light um, sort of installation at St John Square. So I'll, I'll meet you folks there. Okay, folks. So I just snipped through the Winter Gardens. Um, it's quite busy in there. There's a lot of like kids and like dance groups and stuff. I think there's actually an, uh, an event on at the Winter Gardens tonight. Tonight, we're going to have a look at the Winter Gardens. Um, what do you call it? Christmas uh, decorations, that's what, that's what I was going to say. The, the St John's Square, I've got the big tree up as well. But this is what I was going to show you. Um, it's basically like a big, massive bubble um, that was put up a few... I think it, I think it was... Uh, I showed it in my last video that I did. But yeah, this is all some sort of set up. Um, I think there's some lights and stuff around here. This is Cedar Square, by the way. Um, there's some lights in the trees here, we've got some restaurants and stuff there, little cafes. Uh, number five, Caesars uh, Pizza Grill and Pasta, that always smells good there. Um, and then we've got the other, uh, other side of uh, Avenden Street Market here as well. Um, and then we've got some lights and stuff there. And then this is Avenden Street Market that's um, only just been refurbished and open. It does look different inside because I've seen pictures and people's videos about it and stuff. So, so let's leap back around to the Winter Garden, shall we? There's a dog going mental over there, but it's nice and quiet. It's nice and quiet around this area. That's why I sort of like it. Um, but it's, it's it's just good to be out of Fleetwood because, as I said, I've not been out of Fleetwood for like um, not only been out of Fleetwood for like a week and, and a bit. Um, since I did that last video, but it's just been so nice just to be at home and with the weather uh, changing like dramatically now um, It's so so cold here. Look at that shot with the tower in the background Hold on. You see the tower that looks so good um, But yeah with the weather dramatically changing um, It's been uh, I just need to sort of um Stay, stay inside I mean, like um, stay inside in the warmth a bit as well. God, that dog's going mental. Um, but yeah, this is uh, St John's uh, Square Church, and then they've got the big uh, tree up here as well. I need to take a photo of the Winter Gardens um, Christmas decorations as well. But the last, um, the last tree that was here. It actually got knocked over uh, in the wind, so let's quickly go. Uh, let's quickly go over the road, actually, um, just so we can show the uh, decorations. Because the winter gardens look so so nice. I'm going to take a photo of it as well. Um, bear with me one, one moment. I'm going to take a photo. Crikey Moses, folks! That dog's gone absolutely ballistic. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, this is um, the fountains one, by the way, the water fountains. Um, and then uh, over the road is the Winter Lounge and the West Coast Rock Cafe. Gosh, I've got to go that way. So I've got to follow that dog. Um, but the Hound Hill Shopping Centre is open, um, and a couple more shops as well. I think Primark's shut now. Um, I'm, not, I'm not having to talk loud for that dog. Um, but yeah, I shall catch you folks back in the town centre. So I'm back down the town centre now. Um, we've got the tower. 
the scaffolding's not up yet, so I don't think they're doing uh, what's it called, spread. I don't think they're uh, doing any maintenance work to it yet. Um, but I need to have myself a hot, a hot chocolate. Um, I'm going to be doing a, I'm going to be doing a live stream tonight as well. So that's H and B, one of my favourite stores, and then directly next, directly next to it is uh, is Primark. Um, so it's quite pretty. Um, it is quite busy this evening, especially on the Tower Highland, uh, which is to be expected, you know, at this time of year. So, um, and then we've got the uh, the dungeons, Blackpool Tower dungeons there as well. So yeah, I'm, I think um, I'm gonna go back onto the headland. I'm, I'm, I'm doing a live stream tonight, so um, I'll just snip round here. We're gonna have a look at Star Fry, shall we? Um, but yeah, I didn't really want to be. I didn't really want to be able to be a super, super long one because um, it is quite cold and my hands are freezing. But I do have my gloves with me and, and uh, I've got my um, gimbal with me as well. So. Yes. That's Coral Island down there as well. But we're going to have a look at Starflyer just whilst we're around here because that's quite popular. Okay, folks, so this is a Starflyer. It is uh, quite busy tonight on there. So uh, just, let's just watch it go up. I'm going to get myself on this this year and I'll vlog it as well. Um, I will video it. I need to cross my cover, however. I'll cross my cover at the crossing up there. Just near the tower. And then you've got the booster ride up there going as well. But yeah, I'm going to get myself on this this year, I think. Because why not? It's Christmas after all, isn't it? So, so yeah, I'm going to cross my cover here now. And then I will... Um, I'll chat to you folks over there about my drone because um, I'm having issues with, with my drone at the moment so there might there might not be any, any drone footage for a while. That's the Albert and the Lion. Um, yeah there might not be any drone footage for a while until I fix it so I shall catch you folks back over the road. Yeah folks I, I, for, I forgot to mention earlier just before um, as soon as I got into Blackhorn and as soon as I got into the Christmas Christmas village this uh, this couple uh, this this like this like guy and, and woman a couple uh, they they collared me uh, to take a photo of them and and um, the, the, the guy said uh, he's he don't worry he's taken loads before and I said uh, yeah yeah we have quite a few um, so I just took a photo for the for the couple uh, in front of the uh, the bottle sign uh, I took two for them uh, one normal and then like one from like down below because I thought it would be like a bit of a bit of a dynamic shot. Um, but yeah, uh, unfortunately, uh, my drone is out of action um, as it stands because um, I was flying it around the uh, around the corner from where I live uh, the, the other night. Did you see that lens lens flare thingy on the, on the screen? Um, I was flying it uh, around the corner from where I live uh, the other day, the other night, and uh, because it's been so like windy and stuff lately. I think it's sort of um, struggled with the wind, that one of the, one of the blades. Um, so only the three sort of blades work on it now. Uh, only the sort of three, there we go. Um, only three blades sort of, um, oh, so Wilkinson. Yeah, only three work now, um, but I need to, I need to sort of fix it somehow. Um, so it's just out of action. It's a bit of a, a, bit of a shame really because I've, I've really enjoyed sort of flying it. Um, so I've took it apart, the, the blade that's not spinning around properly. What it is, is it, it's not lifting up off the ground properly. And um, that's because one one propeller is stopping, from, stopping it from doing that. Um, it's, it's not focusing very well tonight, is it? Um, but I need to. I've, I've took it apart twice. I've cleaned it all out because I've been fl I've been sort of flying it on the sand and stuff, especially like on Blackpool uh, Beach and uh, Cleavers and no on Fleetwood, and it's got sand in the in the motors. Um, so that I cleaned all the sand and stuff out of it, um, and that did uh, nothing to it. It, it. I thought it, it would help it, but it didn't. Um, but I'm going to take it apart, fully apart again, just that one side. Take the motor out um, and sort of, you know, really see what's wrong with it. But there'll, there'll be no more drone footage for a while until I sort of uh, suss it out and figure it out, figure out what's wrong with it. So, um, yeah, I think. What time are we on now? 
I think what I'm going to do now is it's 5 to 5. I'm going to go and grab a Mackey's hot chocolate, a large one, and sit by the towel for a bit, uh, and then end the video from there. I just didn't want it to be a super long one because it is quite cold. Um, and I just wanted to come out and chill tonight in Blackpool just because I've not been here for like a week, a week and a bit. Um, so yeah, I think that's what my next plan of action is, is to go to Mackey's, get a hot chocolate and just chill by the towel with it for a bit. So I shall catch you folks there. Okay folks, I am gonna end the video here. Um, I've just seen a guy, right, with a, with a gimbal over there. And I was just stood at the side of the, uh, one, of the one of the Christmas huts that was selling curry. It smelled so, so good. Um, but I was just seen a guy, right, with a, with a gimbal. And he was slating off the prices, like how much the, uh, the stuff was. I was like, really? Do, do you really need to do that? Uh, especially, you know, he went right up to the hut as well and showed the prices of the uh, uh, the chips because um, for a portion of chips it's four quid which is not too bad uh, considering considering the uh, the amount of chips that you actually get uh, for four quid but um, it was just going right it's just going round now sort of slating off the uh, prices and stuff of Christmas prices it was like wow wow um, but yeah I'm gonna end the video here um, because I'm going to do a live stream soon. Uh, hopefully it's not as long as the one. Uh, hopefully it's not as long as the one that I did last night. Um, so there he is. You just see him then with the gimbal. He's just going around slating, slating the prices and stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm going to end it here from Christmas by the sea in Botfield. Um, there he is. He's, he's going to sell the hut now. Probably just slate off the prices of that hut as well. God Almighty, some people there. Eh? Um, but yeah, from here on that's how I headland uh, from Christmas Friday. Thank you so so much for watching this video. Uh, give it a like for me if you like uh, if you like this video and um, let me know what you thought of it in the comments below and I shall see you folks in my next video.